all right guys welcome back to the channel uh, today i have a sick video for you guys uh, i'm gonna be breaking down actually i'm just gonna be showing you guys the supplements that i've been taking um uh as of late since i started my cut um i actually got something else in the in the mail so uh another ad something added that i'm gonna add to my supplement snack but uh for now i'm gonna get into what I have so far. First thing I have here is uh, my pre-workout. Uh, I've been off pre-workouts for a long ass time, but this one right here is the Gorilla Mind uh, uh, Gorilla Mode Nitric, and this is a stimulant-free one, so it's not gonna give you that, give you the jitters and shit like that. A lot of people, they look for um, that uh, jittery feeling, the bayality, um for like a sense of like energy you know what i mean like uh um kind of just to get you like psyched up and pumped up for the workout um i'm not a stim freak uh um i have i've never had uh coffee i've never used coffees i've always used like um I've always just food sourced my shit, so it's been a while. It's been like five years since I even like had any type of supplement, um, Terry thing like you know my protein powder, creatines, pre workouts, BCAAs, any of that. Everything has been food food uh, sourced. So um, I started with this right here. Personally, uh, when it comes to supplementary things like. My, I'm a quick responder, so to be honest, like when I when I used to take uh, pre workouts and shit like that, uh, I would literally my favorite pre workout was C4, and I would literally take like half a scoop, like half a scoop of that, and I would feel it everywhere. I feel it in my balls, feel it in my hands, my feet, all in my my cheeks and face, and shit was all itchy. You know, some people like that feeling. I liked that feeling then. But now I don't really like, I don't really crave it as much as I did before I used to like, um, I was like doing more powerlifting, not even power, I was just lifting heavy, like heavy, heavy, heavy shit. So I like kind of like that feeling cause it would psych me up to do the lifts. But um, yeah, so stimulant wise, I don't really look for those things in it. Um, I kind of just look for like it's just an extra boost for me to get into the gym. Um, next, next we have this uh, vitamin D three. Um, vitamin D, like what can you what uh, what do you really need to say about it? Like it's essential super hormone that uh, everyone everyone should be uh, supplementing, um, unless you live in a somewhere where you know you could get as much natural sun as you want but out here in uh surrey british columbia where i'm at we our weather is all over the place so this is definitely needed i for everyone honestly uh this is the thousand i use um i take five thousand i use every day pretty much so that's that like you know vitamin d is responsible for like over 500 off switches in your in your brain so um it's it, it very important to get that in and uh you know fuck with the d3s you know the vitamin d3s and also get as much natural natural sun as you can um second uh is the fish oils so the fish oils oh, i'll shut again fish oils right here omega threes fatty acids what else can you say those are essential things you know your fatty acids um you know i do you know i feel like you can never really have enough of that either you know fish oil so i will do like i'll do about like two a day so two a day is good good for me um most of the time so uh I might uh, do more depending on like, just depending on it. But most of the time I'm doing one in the morning, one uh, in the afternoon type shit. So um, that's that. Another thing is uh, probiotic. Um, I have these, 
not every single day, but I have these just on a day, usually on a day when I eat a lot, when I'm on a higher calorie day, when, um, you know, I'm, I'm, you know, causing more, a little bit more stress on my body than normal when it comes to food intake. So I'm eating in a surplus, I'm eating over the, uh, amount that I usually keep it at. So just to help with digestion in that sudden, uh, change, um, to keep things flowing, uh, I add this in, you know, it's usually like when I'm eating, like when I'm taking like a, uh, um, a more relaxed day and I'm eating like, you know, sushi, you know, going out to, you know, a restaurant and I maybe have a burger or something like that, you know, I'll, I'll throw one of these in just to help with like, you know, overall productivity, right? Um, where are we at? Uh, fourth, creatine monohydrate. So again, another thing, essential thing, creatine, you know, your body naturally produces creatine. Um, I don't, unless you guys want me to, uh, let me know in the comments, but to deep dive into this, it's like, you know, this is one of the most heavily researched Sorry. Anyways, these are one of, this is one of the most heavily researched things, uh, supplements you could buy creatine. Your body naturally produces it. What, what else can I say? I, I take about five grams a, a, a day. Like it says, like it's recommended, recommended. This isn't like a, um, this is just the micronized creatine. So this is not going to bloat you up. It's not going to, it doesn't have, it's just pure creatine. It doesn't have a bunch of filler flavoring added to it. Nothing like that. It's just pure mono high, uh, micronized creatine, um, uh, powder. So this is the one I take. Um, again, this will, this is like vital. My last cut, I didn't have this, you know what I'm saying? So I got to a point in my, um, deficit where I became really flat and I wasn't as full and my muscles weren't as full because, um, uh, the lack of like water and, um, just fullness that, uh, this will give you. And then strength, my strength, you know, went down a bit, especially being in a situation where it was, the gym wasn't as accessible. So this definitely is coming into play heavy right now. Um, in terms of, uh, strength as I'm cutting right now, it's keeping me full. It's keeping my muscles, uh, um, full and, just for yeah again overall productivity and uh, balance like this is amazing to have when you especially when you're cutting and just in general because you know you do you you use these supplementary things responsible and in moderation like again like the they are good for you <laughs> you know they're actually useful you know certain things like creatine you know what i mean uh, next thing is I have this again from Gorilla, Gorilla Mind. Uh, I have this uh, stimulant free fat loss formula. So, this is the first time I'm taking some kind of fat loss, actually, like cycling uh, fat loss uh, uh, supplement. And this is just helps with like as I go deeper and deeper into my deficit, like I didn't add this in the beginning, but as I go deeper and deeper into my deficit, I add this in and it helps with, um, you know, it helps with, you know, controlling my appetite, uh, especially when like you're in that deficit and your body's craving all these things. And you know what I mean? Uh, um, you know, you, you're, you're uh, uncontrollably like, fiending needing to eat more and you know it's the summertime and like you know you smell hot dogs and not fuck hot dogs you smell burgers and you know chicken wings and all that shit this will help you um stick to your diet you know and um, um yeah and, and um also uh you know as soon as i started um adding this in i finally started to like I timed it out again. I timed it out, right? Like you have your diet and your, you know, the amount of cardio you're doing, like, you know, in moderation and, you know, 
taking your time going into things those have to be in check for these supplementary things to work at all so if those are not in check this shit's not gonna work you know what i'm saying so when i added this in and you know slow, you know at first i slowly um you know started cleaning up my diet starting you know moderately adding cardio as it intensified and you know i got i actually got into the, my deficit from maintenance and then i um and then i uh continued you know gradually going deeper deeper into my deficit that's when i added this in at a, at a certain point and um maybe maybe like uh maybe like maybe like 500 to 600 maybe like 600 calories uh under uh into my de deficit from maintenance i added this in and as soon as i did that like pretty quickly i that's when i started seeing the body fat going down on my scale uh, before that, you know, I wasn't seeing any any changes in my body fat. I was still monitoring, paying attention to it, but I know from experience, like it's not gonna just, you know, change overnight. So you had to gradually go into it and, you know, watch your body and manage your body. But as I did that, when I had this in, that's when I actually started seeing my body fat actually dropping on the scale, you know what I'm saying? So, and after, and especially after um seeing my body fat being lower you know at the end of the day you know what i'm saying rather than just in the morning when you're coming out of fasted state right um you know you're coming out of fasted state you wake up you know your body's like replenish doing its re replenishing when it's uh, in that state you know what i'm saying so when you wake up that's why when you wake up you probably see like your body fat is back to you know where you left off you know and and are trying to come down from is because when you wake up you know your body's actually doing its repairing and uh uh um rejuvenating you know when it's in that fasted state you know what i'm saying um or like you know um recovery state when you're sleeping um so yeah so added this body fat started dropping you know what i'm saying and still dropping as i increased my cardio so that's that. So number six here, um, number six here is Gorilla Mind. Again, Gorilla Mind products, man. I, I decided to go with Gorilla Mind uh, for, you know, this fat loss uh, or this, um, you know, cut. Uh, you know, a lot of information. More plates, more dates. Shout out to him. Like a lot of information he has, and he breaks down these products in detail you know what i'm saying so you form your own conclusive thoughts um with what information he gives you about it and you decide whether or not you want to take his product right so i you know looked at it and researched it enough to want to test it out myself and see if it actually works and uh one of the other products i got is this one yeah i should be doing this so you guys to really see but gorilla mode um smooth so this is not the gorilla brush this is uh gorilla mode uh, mine smooth right so this one right here is uh for this is a nootropic so this is for uh cognitive health and this one is just uh a focus um supplement so um, when you're really, really dialing in again, like your mind's going all over the place, you know, like your body is doing, you know, your body is essentially going into like survival mode when you're deep, you're depleting and depriving it of, uh, under what is maintainly required for it to function. Right. So when you're depriving it of that to you know get to a certain um goal in body fat which can be un which in for too long could be unhealthy put you at risk and so um this just helps you um this just helps with the uh, uh the like you know punishment that you're taking <laughs> that you're essentially putting your body through um 
again it helps with the focus like uh this cut i've never been you know more focused uh ever you know what i'm saying um when it comes to just uh being able to go in the gym and uh well like my last cut no without any supplements honestly like i was there was a point where i was literally like falling asleep like driving home and shit like i was literally like like i literally the i almost pulled over like multiple times to just sleep on the side like just close my eyes on the side of like the highway literally about to like take the next exit because like i was just like that depleted and like again like just like just that my body was just that under pressure when it came to um you know the cardio and you know the workouts and then the the um um the nutrition and shit you know and the deficit and everything you know it was like really 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 tough right and no supplementary help so uh yeah this just helps with um uh, getting just pushing you through that um, uh, state that your body is in essentially so uh, Gorilla Minds uh, Smooth right here amazing product um, I'm, I'm gonna do another video on this so yeah um, now for the next for the last so last but not least um yeah, to be honest, I still didn't add a protein. Um, yeah, like I said, I got this in the... I w actually, I had to go pick this up because I wasn't home when they dropped it off. But see, see if I can open this with those scissors. Um, but this product right here... Yeah. So this product right here... Hold up. Alright, guys, so... Right here, I have these these next things that I bought here. What do you know? Again, Gorilla Mind products right here that I'm going to try. So the first one is this here. Boom, curcumin. So curcumin. Um, this product right here um, is good for cardiovascular health. Um, it actually has uh properties that help with bioavailability so um i'm thinking of actually taking this when i'm when i peak in my uh diet and then i'm slowly you know going into my refeed uh stage when i'm kind of you know trying to you know fill myself back out and not be in such a harsh deficit i'll probably add this in then um again to help with you know bioavailability when i'm switching from being in a more deprived state to uh you know eating more adding back in more foods and then going into even above maintenance so this will be useful then uh in terms of you know have making sure you know my body is able to even metabolize the increase in you know uh food that i actually add afterwards so this right here um again uh cardiovascular health you know um joint and longevity you know uh this is all useful this is curcumin this is useful for those things and um he did a really uh they did a really good job while well, Derek he did a really good job um in um uh exactly the things the other things like the scientific things that he put into this one supplement versus you know other brands you know that you look to get curcumin in or other brands with curcumin um that uh you know wouldn't provide uh such a good balance of you know things all into one so one capsule so this right here is good good man again i just wanted to add like you know uh also immune support 
you know, it's anti-inflammatory. Uh, me personally, I also use um, uh, turmeric. You know, I cook with that, especially in my meats. I'll even toss it in my like eggs. When I'm scrambling my eggs, I'll toss a little bit of turmeric in there. And like, you know, that's uh, acts as an anti-inflammatory as well. But, you know, this anti-inflammatory as well. Um, you know, sometimes I have uh, a little bit of inflammation in the shoulder because I, I have a tweaked shoulder. You know, sometimes, um, again, when it comes to, uh, you know, being in the deficit and trying to still lift heavy and um, utilize mus muscle growth at the same time, um, that could take a lot and cause a lot of stress to your body. So this helps with stress. Um, this also helps with, uh, you know, again, bioavailability, cardiovascular health, and just like, it just supports like normal um, functionalities and uh, joint health. So, um, yeah. So the second thing, or the last thing, astragalus uh, um, extract here. And this one is, again, I'm, I'm, runner now you know i do like my form of cardio my favorite form of cardio is running so um you know um it's a lot of stress on again joints and um you know cardio my cardiovascular health uh take is challenged because of the fact that you know i do have more muscle than the average well you know it's just more it's more of a eccentric load that you know i'm carrying when i'm going for my runs and stuff so uh you know that is gonna cause you know you know more damage to my joints when i'm running it's again it's have it's uh harder on my health to um even sorry uh it's it's just more stress on my heart, on the heart, you know what I mean, uh, to adapt to carrying around, you know, all the the weight and shit. So um, I want to make sure that you know that my cardiovascular health is in check uh, when it comes to um, uh, you know my runs and everything like that. And again, being in a deficit, uh, this also. Um, has its uh, uh attributes to um uh kidney uh kidney uh functionality so that's a big one for me um monitoring my kidneys i actually have a kidney specialist who um i go to and he monitors my uh kidneys for me and lets me know what's going on uh and runs different tests like s s specific tests and and uh, all that for me for my kidneys keep those healthy and in check especially when you're supplementing uh you always want to be checking up with your doctor and shit and uh that's yeah that's pretty much it um um yeah just again immune immune function you know cell functionality like that's all important um when you're taking on these things and uh again you want to make sure you have a, a keep a balance so adding these things will help keep that balance preserve the, that balance um you know there's a lot of things that can uh, uh happen when you are supplementing and you know not doing the other works to go along with it or to utilize them in the proper way so you know you're having your health in check you're having your training in check and you're having your recovery which is these will help with that and you know your sleep um so you gotta check all those things off first before you even think about stepping into the world of supplementary things especially um go to your doctor and 
you know, ask them for professional help. You know, I'm just saying what I do, you know, what I've researched and uh, what I've talked to my doctor about. And he knows exactly every single thing that I put in my body. He knows every brand. He knows it by brand. He knows it by amount, everything. He knows exactly what I'm doing and what I'm taking. So I could get the best professional advice uh, and uh, overlook on uh, outlook on what is actually going on internally as I monitor what's going on externally. You know what I mean? So yeah. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I try to make this as fast as I can, could, but yeah. Uh, if you have any more further questions, uh, let me know in the comments. Um, if you want to know, I don't know, maybe a further breakdown of a particular product and my experience with them um, and how they're treating me, let me know in the comments. Other than that, Peace.